I am Scatterbrain, and this is the Scattered Adventures. My hat looks weird. <laughs> so today we are here, back in, back on the mountain, the big old mountain. It is a very high, very very high mountain. Can't even see the ground over there. So let's go check on the farm real quick. The farm is doing very well, actually. We are getting tons of stuff. Can I just pick these? Um, no. I guess I have to destroy. No. Maybe if I... Oh, I don't have any room in my inventory. Let's get rid of these zombie heads. Nope, I can't pick them. Have to destroy them. I'll do that later. But yes, the farm is going on well. I have tons of food right now, so I don't really need any. But if I do run out, I can go get some. Uh, we have... I mean, there's wheat in here. There's barley, each of which make, you know, the... Wow. The words is what I'm looking for. No. Um... <laughs> Each of which make the, uh, make the bread equally fine. The bread, the bread tastes just as good coming from, coming from barley as it does from wheat. Trust me. I, I know. <laughs> Alright, so, I went mining and I've got a bunch of iron that needs to cook up. And I've got a bunch of coal that I can toss in there with the iron. That's good. And that's cooking up. I'm gonna eat. Oops. While that's cooking up, I mean I'm gonna eat. Eat, eat, eat. So, oh, I opened that again. Last episode I made the wrong thing, and I tried to go get the correct stuff for the correct mag, uh, correct furnace, but all, I, I couldn't find, I couldn't find any blaze in the nether. It was infuriating, like how, how often do you go to the nether and never find a blaze? I mean, really, really, how often? <laughs> So, I didn't find any blaze, so I didn't get any blaze powder, which meant I couldn't make any magma cream, which meant I couldn't make the blast furnace, but it's okay. I do have all of the ingredients here, if you can't see, seared bricks, for the, for the smeltery. And down here, actually, I've cleaned out the room, so it's gonna go right here, here, so actually, let's, um, let's put some torches up, that's a good idea. Torches are, torches are a plus. Put one there. And I, I will redo the floor soon. I'm just, you know, I'm not working on aesthetics right now. I'm trying to work on function. Okay, so the way the smell tree works, it's a three by three. So let's, what is that? Two on each side? Perfect. And then I believe it's like this. And like this. And like this. And then this is where you put your your um your things your <laughs> the ingredients you need uh the the uh uh okay wow i'm really not doing well tonight this is where you put your ores and this is where the uh the bricks are going to go but first let's go upstairs and we have to make all this stuff um and let's hope i can keep my mind set on this project right now for some reason i just i'm very uh Scatterbrain today, <laughs> if you were. All right, so let's go here, and we can. What I need to do first is I need to make a uh, smell tree. Smell smell tree control. Well, that's a seared tank. You know what? We do need the seared tank. So let's let's grab that. Oh, I don't have glass. I believe there's glass in this one. Where to go? Where's the glass? It can't be in this one. It would have gotten it out. Okay, so it's got to be in this one. Um, glass, glass, glass. There it is. Found it, everybody. I found it. Yay. All right, let's get the seared tank. Uh, there. So let's grab one of those. And let's grab all these back because we don't want to make all those in the seared tank. We only need one seared tank. And then let's grab a few smell. Uh, we're going to grab three smeltery drains. Is that two? Yep. Three smeltery drains, perfect. Let's grab all of these back. I want these back, please. All right, and there. Okay, so we have those, and now the next thing we need is the smeltery controller. 
Where is that? Smeltery controller. Is that it? No, that's a drain. Did I make the... I made the right drains, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, glass tank, glass window, smelt... What does that say? Seared road. What is a seared... I, I kind of want to know what that is. Um, can you make it? Nope, there's no crafting recipe for seared road, unfortunately. I think it's I think it's just a weird item you find find in like biomes of plenty, which it, oh spelter controller found it. All right, and that's pretty easy. We can why is there no question mark here? Wait, hold on, smeltery controller. Uh, well, I mean, it's not hard. I just I, I like the question mark. It's a it's a neat function there. <laughs> Oh, because I'm not on a crafting table. What am I doing? What am I doing? Um, smeltery controller. So there we go. What? Fine. I'll do it myself. Grr. Smeltery controller. Perfect. Uh, we don't need this string. Now, we, have, we need faucets, which I know how to make those offhand. Faucets are like this and we're gonna need three of them because we have three drains So there's that and then let's put these back the string. Okay, let's get three of these one two three Give me them. Thank you And then we gotta we're gonna find somewhere to put them. What what is that? But oh, it's just jungle brick All right All right, everybody we are now about to learn how to put together a smell tree Let's go down here and we're going to go in our room and we need to turn a bunch of bricks into seared bricks. So let's get all those and put them in our inventory. I don't think this is not obviously nearly enough, but it's what we have for now and it'll do. It'll do. All right. Whoa, whoa, dude. Whoa, why? Why would you give me that? What? <laughs> on In what world would you... Okay. So the drains are going to go... Not there. Is that... No, that's that's not right. Can, can you... Can you please? Yeah, see, it's supposed to be like that. Uh, okay, that's weird. Now they're just setting up however they feel like. All right. Well, let's let's get a little bit more room to work in here. Because clearly we don't have enough. <laughs> We're going to need to put a lot more stuff. Like there's a lot of Tinker stuff. Tinker's is so much fun. It's a great mod. Um, it'll be a lot of fun to play with. Let's get those. Um, okay. There's the tank. Now the tank you put over here. And that's where the lava goes in. Uh, well, that's not actually the tank. That's a drain. What is going on here? Okay, these are smeltery drains. Seared tank. That's the controller. Seared tank. Please. Okay. Are we all are we all in doing what we're supposed to be doing? Thank you. Okay, now smeltery drains. Let's try and get these set correctly. There we go. Perfect. Okay. We just need more room to work. Now, let's get to more of these. Yay. I don't know what that voice was. Sorry. <laughs> okay. And then we need to fill in the floor as well. Because that's important. There, there. Come on. There. And that's not right. I've done made a mistake. Whoops a daisy. Seared brick, seared brick. And one, two, three. There we go. Now, we just need to go grab some lo- Ooh, we need one here. Oh, see? It's making, it's making, that means we put it together right. Yay, we put it together right. I've done something right. <laughs> Let's move this wall out a bit because we need some more room to work. I didn't realize quite, I, I guess I, I underestimated quite how big this thing was going to be. So, all right, we have more room here now. And I think maybe I'll just, I think I'll move the door over a few. Uh, <laughs> um, all right, there we go. So let's, Hop up here and go up, 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 but up, up, up. We are gonna need to go grab some for that to work. We're gonna need uh, lava, 
But we don't quite need that right now. We'll get back to that. It's made and that's what we needed done. Because we need to put the pig iron ore into there so we can get four instead of two. Because that's what the smeltery does. Uh, we're going to need that. We do need those still. We're going to make it bigger. You can make it bigger. Let's go to bed. You can make it bigger and that way you can fit more ores in. But right now, I need to, I need, see my checklist over here? I have, uh, go to the nether for steel. I've done that, even though I didn't find very much. I need to get more. Um, make quarry and wind turbines. Okay, so, to, in order to do that, I need my metallurgic infuser to work. And in order to make the metallurgic infuser work, I have to make a combustion engine. Because, if you remember, I made a... A redstone engine before and that that did nothing absolutely nothing it was useless and so we need to do this so we need iron gears which is really easy let's grab the iron out okay so iron gears are really easy all you have to do is this and you have iron gears there we go now the next thing we need is some glass let's grab that back out um as I blindly fumble around looking there it is <laughs> I found it and we are gonna need a piston which is redstone cobblestone and some wood so let's grab some cobble that I'll that I just put all away and let's grab the wood out and I believe I have tons of redstone somewhere redstone redstone all right Let's make this combustion engine. Combustion engine, and let's do that. Uh, what are we missing? What are we missing? Oh yeah, that's right, we need to make the piston first. So let's grab the piston, and then let's make the combustion engine. Oh, wow. That was odd. <laughs> um, let's, uh, let's go ahead and try that again. What is going on here? <laughs> uh, there we go. All right, let's go ahead and try that one again. There we go, combustion engine, that's what we needed. Okay, so I believe I have the metallurgic infuser in this chest over here. Uh, I don't. Uh-oh. Uh, hold on, let me just uh, go searching for the metallurgic infuser here. Metallurgic infuser, I've put it somewhere. Um, that's obvious, right? <laughs> uh, faucets, we need those, we need to actually put them on, oop, there it is. Okay, so the metallurgic infuser, uh, let's let's put it in the nether room for now. Okay, so the, the metallurgic infuser has to go down first. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Let's put the metallurgic infuser here. And let's put the combustion engine here. And now we do need to go get lava. And I have a bucket. I do, you know what? Actually, forget, forget about the bucket. We're just going to make three new buckets. And... Let's go grab some lava. Where's my sword? It's really dangerous out here, I found out. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, you know what? Ooh, wait a minute. Where am I? I, I, between episodes, I killed a wasp. There we go. So I can fly now. Which is good. Because flying helps. Um, we kind of slowly though. We're not flying very quickly. Down here, because down here is the, uh, Wow, that ravine is like right there. That's crazy. I, I didn't really look how close the ravine actually was. All right, here's the lava pit. If you don't remember this, uh, we can't take fall damage. <laughs> I mean, we can take fall damage. We don't want to. All right, there we, there we go. All full. And actually, we can just we can just teleport back to the house. That'll be quicker. Home teleport two. We're at the home. All right. In order to make the combustion engine work, you have to do two things. One, get through the doorway, which I seem to be struggling with greatly. Let's, uh, apparently the wasp is a little bit bigger than I thought. Uh, the other thing you need, well, you need to put the lava in, and then you need, oh geez, and then you need <laughs> to not burn the house down. Uh... There's a lot of rules in this in, in this combustion chamber. Can't burn the house down. You gotta get through the door. You know, <laughs> no, you need a lever. 
And then what we do is we walk over to this thing and we pop our lava in. And do that. And do that. Pop the lava in. And then we take our levers. And we pop the lever above it. And it go it starts going. And this Sir, please please stop. Alright, and this should start filling Yup, filling up with energy. Perfect. Now in order the let me show you the wind turbine recipe real quick. Uh, we're not gonna get to making it quite in this episode, but I do want to show it to you because this is what we're working for. So we need osmium, enriched alloy, these energy tablets, and this control circuit. Now we need the control cer ooh, wrong control circuit. That one's way too complex. We need the metallurgic confuser and some redstone and an osmium ingot, and we get the control circuit. That's that's good. And these enriched alloys are really easy. You put redstone in, and you put an iron ingot, and you get one out. So that's what we're going to do right now. We have the redstone. We have some iron. How many do we need? So two for that. So two, four, five. Okay, so we need five. Let's toss. Let's toss. Um, okay, we don't want this to get too hot. That's the only problem. And I think if it stores up too much energy, it gets too hot. I think that's how it works. I'm not quite sure but I, you know what I don't really know I have no idea how that thing works and I probably shouldn't even be trying to explain it so one two three four five six and if you look at this we have 60 redstone in there and that's what we need so then we're gonna ta pop in the enrich or we're gonna pop in the iron one two three four five uh, that's six one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And that will give us our enriched alloy. Now, to get the control circuit, we're going to have to put an osmium ingot in there. But we are going to sadly have to do that in the next episode. Because this is taking a moment. Oh, because there's no power. Power! Okay, there we go. There we go. Well, actually, we might be able to get the osmium. Ooh, let's just go get some osmium. Hold on. I really want to I really want to finish this. Uh, osmium. I know I have some ingots. There they are. Um, how do you make those control circuits again? Uh, those things, gold and redstone. I have gold. I have tons of gold. For whatever reason, I have tons and tons of gold. There we go. Let's get these control circuits out. Uh, where are they? Five? Five, yes. Okay, let's turn this off because I'm pretty sure those things will blow up. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty confident they will if you let them overheat. And that, that won't be good. Will not be good at all. Okay, so, ooh, let's actually, we need to plunk a, um, we need to plunk a osmium ingot in here. And that should start doing that, yep. So let's get our osmium ingot into that control circuit real quick. And we will go from there. There we go. Basic control circuit. Perfect. We're doing so well. All right. Now we're going to come over here and we're going to do this like that. And we need two of them. One. Oh, yeah. We can't stack them. I forgot. And then, yeah, that we should be able to make this. Hold on. Oh, you know what? I guess we can't do the question mark. Okay, perfect there. And osmium, osmium, where are you? There you are, osmium. One, two, three. I'm going to probably make another one in between episodes because we're not going to, we're going to need more than one. But I've got the wind turbine. Yes. Okay, let's go plunk this outside and look at it. Oh, awesome. I have a wind turbine. I'm so happy. I'm excited. All right. But we have sadly run out of time in this episode. We have accomplished a lot, actually. I have the metallurgic infuser working. I have a wind turbine. And that means in the next episode, I can finally build the quarry. And we can start and we can set the quarry off to mine. And it'll be so much fun. I'm going to get in between episodes. I'm going to probably make one more of those. Well, you know, the, the wind turbine. I'm going to get some lava for the for the smell tree. I'm probably going to finish off the smell tree too. And then in the next episode, we will set up the turbo turbine 
quarry! Yay! But, sadly, again, we have run out of time <laughs> in this episode. If you did enjoy the episode, don't forget to leave a like or a comment. And if you are new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe. I always appreciate it when people subscribe. And I will see you all in the next episode.